you may already be aware of how important teeth are to your appearance. But you may not know how missing teeth can harm your dental health. Even a tooth that does not show when you smile must be replaced because all of your teeth work together to help you chew, speak, and smile. If a tooth is missing, these simple actions may become difficult to do. A missing tooth may cause the surrounding teeth to shift or become crooked and can change your bite. This can lead to cavities, gum disease, and bite problems. A missing tooth in the lower jaw may even cause a tooth in the upper jaw to move downward into the empty space. You might start chewing only on one side of your mouth, causing extra stress on your jaw joints. Or it can affect your bite and place unusual stress on your teeth. It may also cause your face to look older, or you may find it difficult to talk or chew food. However, thanks to tooth replacements, you have a few options to replace missing teeth. Depending on your specific needs, your dentist may recommend implants, fixed bridges, or removable partial dentures. Let's look at each option. An implant is a replacement tooth that attaches to your jawbone with a post that acts like a tooth root. Implants are secure and stable and are most similar to your natural teeth in look and feel. They can be used to replace individual teeth or to support complete or partial dentures. Unlike some of the other tooth replacement options, the implant procedure does not involve your adjacent teeth. Implants can also help prevent shrinkage of the jawbone that occurs from missing teeth. Although implants are a good replacement for natural teeth, they're not for everyone since surgery is necessary. Patients need to be in good overall health, have healthy gums, and there must be enough bone to support an implant. If you and your dentist determine implants are best for you, there are a few steps that will be taken. First, surgery is performed to implant the metal post beneath your gum line and into the jawbone. This post fuses to the bone in your jaw and becomes the new root of the tooth. Depending on how fast your mouth heals, it may take up to six months for the bone to grow around the implant and securely hold it in place. Next, your dentist makes a crown or a replacement tooth. The crown is designed to fit and blend in with the look and feel of your natural teeth. Once the healing is complete, the crown is attached to the post. In some cases, your dentist can use a special technique in which the implant and post are already one unit and positioned in the mouth during the first surgery. Anesthetic may be used in pain medication or antibiotics prescribed as needed. After the procedure, your dentist will give you specific instructions on diet and oral hygiene. Fixed bridges cover the space where one or more teeth have been lost. A fixed bridge is a permanent restoration that can only be removed by your dentist. Fixed bridges are similar to natural teeth. They're stable and comfortable. Bridges are made from metal, ceramics, or a combination of the two. Your dentist will work with you to determine what is best for your smile. A fixed bridge is attached to the natural teeth next to the space left by the missing tooth. An artificial tooth, called a pontic, takes the place of the lost natural tooth. Crowns on either side of the pontic are bonded or cemented to the adjacent teeth. To prepare the adjacent teeth for the bridge, the dentist removes some of the tooth structure to make room for the crowns to fit over them. The custom-made bridge is fitted and adjusted, and then the bridge is cemented into place. A third option for tooth replacement is a removable bridge, also known as a removable partial denture. A removable partial denture is often less expensive than a fixed bridge or implant and can be removed from the mouth for cleaning. Removable partial dentures typically have the replacement teeth attached to a gum-colored plastic base connected by a metal framework. They attach to your natural teeth with either metal clasps or devices called precision attachments. Having crowns on your natural teeth may improve the way a removable partial denture fits your mouth. 
Usually, it takes some practice to insert and remove a new removable partial denture. But after the first few weeks, your mouth will get used to it. Your dentist will provide you with instructions on how long to wear your removable partial denture. Often, when you first get a denture, you will be asked to wear it for the first 24 hours to identify parts that require adjustment. If there's too much pressure on a certain area, tell your dentist. He or she can adjust the removable partial denture as needed to fit more comfortably. Once all adjustments have been made, it's often recommended that the denture be removed while you sleep and replaced in your mouth in the morning. It's important to continue keeping your teeth and gums healthy. Replacements can lose support if the jawbone or surrounding teeth become damaged by dental disease. Brush twice daily and floss, or use an interdental cleaner daily. Over time, your mouth can change, so be sure to continue to schedule regular checkups and professional dental cleanings with your dentist. Options like implants, fixed bridges, and removable partial dentures can make important everyday actions much more pleasant, like eating and speaking. It's important to choose the treatment that's best for you, so be sure to speak with your dentist to explore the pros and cons for each type of replacement. With tooth replacement, you can have a beautiful, functional smile for years to come. <laughs>